An argument on a red line train escalates into violence. I was terrified. I was shaking. Before that push, an argument over cell phone recording leads to this. It was a punch right to the face, right to his lip. He had a fat, bloody lip. Shannon Schultz behind the camera phone. You know, I just wanted to make sure I caught this on tape. Schultz riding the red line towards Braintree just before 9 on Friday night. Before she started recording, Schultz claims this man was bullying other passengers. He was clearly intoxicated. He was saying some pretty racist things. He caused issues with a group of black kids, Asian girls, Indian men. Go back to India. Schultz says here, the man tried to punch her, but she was able to prevent him from hitting her in the face. Conduct and behavior such as that will not be tolerated on the MBTA. We showed these videos to Lieutenant Richard Sullivan of the MBTA police. He says they know the identity of this man. And appropriate charges will be brought. Schultz tells News Center 5 everyone involved got off at Quincy Center, and she showed T officers these same videos. But Schultz claims the man who threw the punch was allowed to walk away, and she was told there was no need to send these videos to police. I'm angered that it wasn't taken more seriously. Lieutenant Sullivan says that's part of the investigation. We will talk to all parties involved to include the police officers. Schultz just relieved she escaped unhurt. I just can't believe this happened. It was so scary. And back out here live, T police obviously taking this very seriously now. Lieutenant, Vince, Lieutenant Sullivan tells me this investigation will now focus on charges against the man who threw the punch, figuring out what happened before the cell phone recording began, and also figuring out exactly what happened between Schultz and the T officers here at Quincy Center.